Numbers on a scale. This is the sort of question we get at the start of GCSE foundation exams. Um, whenever you're looking at a number scale, you need to work out what each gap represents. So if we're looking between 7 and 8, and we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 parts, then that means each one's going to be 0.1. So it's going to be 7.1. It's going to be that one. Then 7.2, 7.3, and so on. So 7.5 would be in the middle. 7.6, 7.7. Okay, here's another one. So this time we're going up um, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for 10. So if we went up 1, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, that one wouldn't work. So if we go up by 2, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, that, was, that, that works quite nicely. So that's going to be 32. Okay, now we've got to mark on. A number with it, the arrow. So we're trying to mark a number minus 8.3. So coming from this end, here we have 10 gaps between. So this is back to this earlier one, the point ones for each one. So this is 8 minus 8. And as we go this way, this is going to be minus 8.1. As we go this way, we're going to have minus 7.9. So we need to go to 8.3. So it's 8.1 minus 8.2 minus 8.3 and we need to mark that with an arrow. And we could even write underneath what it is. Okay, there we go, just a number scale basic question. One mark each.